uh, welcome to my Blu-ray update. Uh, in this, I have some steelbooks, animated steelbooks, some Japanese animation, uh, a western, <coughs> one of M. Night Shyamalan's uh, newest movie, or Shyamalan Ding Dong, <laughs> um, and a couple of arrows. So, let's start things off. I have Teen Titans, The Judas Contract. Uh, this is the Target Steelbook. Looks really nice. I mean, hell, here lately, <coughs> I like DC's animation more than their live action. Uh, in this, you get the Blu-ray DVD and digital HD. And there's your spine. And on the back, the special features, you get... Titanic Minds, Reuniting Wolfman and Perez, Villain Rising Deathstroke, two bonus cartoons, plus a sneak peek at DC Universe's next animated movie, Batman and Harley Quinn. So that'll be interesting to check out. And I heard that this was pretty good. Uh, this is PG-13 and 84 minutes. So that was T Teen Titans The Judas Contract Steelbook. This is from Target. And then next up, um, I was, you know, ready to blind buy some Japanese anime that I haven't checked out. And <clears throat> I saw a trailer for this and it seemed really interesting. And that is My Hero Academia. Uh, this is season one. And it's from Funimation. You get Blu-ray DVD. It's a Blu-ray DVD combo pack. And there's your spine. And on the back, you get Meet the Characters Anime Expo 2016 panel, Anime Fest 2016 artist sketches inside the episodes, interviews with cast and crew, simulus trailer, textless songs, and trailers. Uh, one of the things that really interested me about this is uh, instead of him being born with his powers or whatever, he has to earn his powers. And I think that's a really cool concept. So that was My Hero Academia. And then next up is the Western. And it has one of my favorite classic uh, actors. And that is James Stewart in Broken Arrow. This is put out by Kino. And unfortunately, there's no bonus features. It's from 1950, 93 minutes. Not rated. And it says, a 2K restoration. The year is 1870, and former Union soldier Tom Jeffords, James Stewart, no highway in the sky is recruited to remove a tribe of Apache warriors from a U.S. mail delivery route by any means necessary. Jeffers chooses peace instead of more killings and decides to learn the Apache way of life. He agrees to a peace treaty with Apache chief Cochise Jeff Chandler, 10 seconds to hell, and marries a beautiful Native American woman, Deborah Paget, Cry of the City. Tragedy strikes after the sellers break the peace treaty, but now it's Cochise trying to stop Jeffers from acting out in vengeance. Delmer Daves, 310 to Yuma, directed this classic action-packed western that was nominated for Academy Awards. Best Supporting Actor Chandler, Best Color Cinematography by Ernest Palmer, Blood and Sand, and Best Screenplay by Blacklisted Albert Maltz, Two Meals for Sister Sarah. And of course, that's James Stewart right there. Yeah, I have this, I believe, like in a combo pack, but... I wanted uh, Blu-ray once I saw that this was going to be available. And I really dig that artwork right there. Looks really cool. And then next up, 
I got the movie Split, starring James McAvoy. Includes deleted scenes, alternate ending, and more. And this is uh, Blu-ray and DVD Digital HD. And you do get some bonus features. It's PG-13. Yeah, I've heard some mixed things about this, but most of what I heard was pretty good, and I wanted to check it out for myself. And then next up, I have a Blu-ray from uh, Takashi Miike. <clears throat> and that is the Dead or Alive trilogy. Um, I heard the picture quality on this wasn't that great, but, you know, I kind of figured that since it was made on the cheap, so... But I don't own too many of Mike's uh, movies, so I figured this would be another good addition because I believe I have uh, Ichi the Killer. So I wanted to go ahead and check this sucker out. And you do get a decent amount of bonus features. Let's see, I guess for the first movie it's 105 minutes. Then it's 97 minutes and 89 minutes. So that'll be interesting to check out. And that is Takashi Miike's Dead or Alive trilogy. Dead or Alive, Dead or Alive 2 Birds, Dead or Alive Final. And then next up, I know a lot of people got this, and I definitely had to get it because it looked, you know, it's been a super long time since I've seen it, but I remember that it being really weird and really cool. And that is the Donnie Darko box set. And there's a little tear up there, but at least it didn't affect the box set. Um, <clears throat> I was originally going to get the UK box set, but that sold out super quick. So I got the US edition. There's your spy, Donnie Darko. And there's the bottom. This is Region A. Not rated. 113 minutes and I believe 133 minutes for the director's cut edition. <clears throat> and there's your list of bonus features. And that is awesome. I can't I definitely can't wait to check this out again and revisit it. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed my uh haul. I wanna thank y'all for watching my video. Y'all have a great one.